going to pan over that for a minute. Look at that. Hi there. And me and Chris are now in Stratford in, in East London, just a short distance from the Olympic Park. Um, now, I've been to this area before and I've got a map about 15 years old. Basically, that, my, my map's completely useless. This whole area, the district has been transformed. Now, we just got off the uh, Stratford uh, Docklands Light Railway Station and, and Overground Station and we come across this. It's rather strange. It looks like a, almost a forest of objects that could be anything. Now, there's no, we don't know, it's a piece of modern art, but uh, what do you think of this, Chris? Shit. <laughs> it's weird, isn't it? It yeah, is. It's hmm. UFOs, maybe, or that's why. Who, who knows? From one angle, you could see that it's a, a fleet of saucer-shaped UFOs. That's one possibility. Uh, it's hard to say for sure, but I mean, there's all these weird art pieces, works of art, appearing everywhere, aren't they? I mean, have you have you seen um, others? Uh, yeah. I mean, we're going to see one, um, uh, obviously, at the Olympic Stadium. Mm -hmm. um, there's that horse's head. The horse's head at uh, yeah, Marble Arch. Yeah, Marble Arch. Yeah. Uh, looks, from one angle, it looks very phallic. And yeah. you get to the other side, you see it's a horse in there. And um, we were talking earlier about how it reminded you of the film The Godfather. Yeah, the horse's head in the bed. There's one famous, yeah, no, famous, very gruesome scene yeah. where a man wakes up to find his, his favourite horse has had his head cut off from the mafia yeah. and put it in his bed. Now, yeah. um, just, you can't see it from here, but the Westfield Centre is near, isn't it? Yeah, Westfield yeah. Shopping Centre. Now, who owns that? Um, well, the co-founder of Westfields is a guy called Frank Lowy. He's an Australian who was the business partner of Larry Silverstein mm. uh, when they invested in the World Trade Center complex. Uh, I think it was about six six months before the um, yeah. before the uh, World Trade Center disaster. Six months or six weeks mm. or something like that. Mm. Uh, and obviously they made billions on that and it was a total false flag attack and mm. uh, so you know with all this talk of terrorism at this olympics and and frank lowey uh silverstein's partner being the co-founder of westfields maybe it doesn't bode well for the westfield center surviving yeah. too much longer Who it knows? is it is very close to the olympic stadium and it'd be worth looking into whether um they've updated the insurance policy on it yeah because if, if silverstein hadn't updated his insurance policy before he pulled all those I, would, seven and nine. I would wager there's a terrorism clause in there somewhere. Yeah, probably would be. I would yeah. wager that. Okay. Yeah. Right, well, we're going to go on to the next point of interest now. Thank you for watching. See you in a minute.